2023 Mercedes-Benz EQS SUV. Starting at $114 est. Overview. As its name implies, the all-electric 2023 Mercedes-Benz EQS is the high-riding SUV alternative to the company's large, slicked-back EQS luxury sedan. The two share a platform and myriad other components and have identical wheelbases, but only the SUV offers a third row and seats for up to seven. Its interior feels airier than the sedan thanks to extra headroom, and its design and material quality are equally high-end and similarly attractive. It's also available with Mercedes' new 56-inch hyperscreen, but while we're dazzled by the massive glass panel Starship Enterprise appearance it stretches across the dashboard from door to door we're put off by its lack of physical controls. The lineup includes the rear drive, 355 HP EQS 480 Plus and the all-wheel drive, 536 HP EQS 580, both of which we expect to at least 300 miles of estimated range. What's new for 2023? The 2023 EQS SUV is the latest to join Mercedes' growing portfolio of electric models that fall under the umbrella of the company's EQ sub-brand. It's the first SUV built on Mercedes' modular electric vehicle platform, which also underpins the EQE and EQS sedans, and it's expected to go on sale sometime later this year. Pricing and which one to buy? EQS 450 Plus $114,000, EST. EQS 580. $130,000, EST. Mercedes hasn't yet said how much the 2023 EQS SUV will cost, but we know it'll be split into two models, the EQS 450 Plus and the EQS 580. We expect the latter to be considerably more coin because of its added power and all-wheel drive. Still, the EQS 450 Plus includes a lot of desirable standard features, such as an adaptive air suspension, rear axle steering, heated and ventilated front seats, a panoramic sunroof, a Burmester sound system, and more. EV motor, power, and performance. The EQS SUV is essentially a rebodied EQS sedan with an elevated seating position and more interior space, and its electric powertrains are similar albeit not identical. The EQS 450 Plus features a 335 HP electric motor that powers the rear wheels. The EQS 580 produces 536 horsepower and 633 pound-feet of torque between its front and rear mounted electric motors, which provide all-wheel drive. The EQS SUV comes standard with an adjustable air suspension and a rear axle steering system that makes it surprisingly agile. Unlike the sedan, the SUV features an off-road drive mode that raises the suspension and alters the powertrain's behavior. During a ride along in a prototype model, we experienced these settings firsthand on rugged terrain and were impressed with the vehicle's capabilities, even if we're convinced most people who buy an EQS SUV will never attempt such activities. Range, Charging, and Battery Life Although Mercedes hasn't confirmed range estimates for the EQS SUV, it uses the same 107.8 kWh battery pack as the EQS sedan, which is EPA rated at between 340 and 350 miles of range. Due to the SUV being less aerodynamic and likely heavier, we expect its estimated range to be slightly lower. The EQS SUV can charge at speeds up to 200 kW, which Mercedes says will take the battery from 10 to 80% in 31 minutes when connected to a compatible DC fast charger. Interior, Comfort, and Cargo Inside, the EQS SUV features the type of rich materials and high-tech equipment that define modern-day Mercedes-Benz models. Its list of standard interior features include selectable ambient lighting, heated and ventilated front seats, leather upholstery, a panoramic sunroof, and wireless charging. The 56-inch hyperscreen is optional. The fit and finish of the EQS we rode in was very impressive even though it was a pre-production model. The EQS cabin is also rife with useful storage spaces, including a large bin below the floating center console. The EQS comes standard with two rows of seats that accommodate five passengers, but a third row is optional and adds seating for two more people. 
there's up to 31 cubic feet of cargo area behind the second row on five-seater models. Those fitted with the third row max out at 28 cubes behind the second row, but that volume shrinks to 7 cubes when the third row isn't stowed. Infotainment and Connectivity For maximum theater, the EQS SUV can be equipped with Mercedes mesmerizing 56-inch hyperscreen, which stretches across the wall width of the dashboard. Along with housing the digital gauge cluster, it hosts a 17.7-inch touchscreen that's primarily responsible for infotainment functions, plus a 12-point UV also has a self-parking feature. For more information about the EQS SUV's crash test results, visit the National Highway Traffic Safety Administration, NHTSA, and Insurance Institute for Highway Safety, IIHS, websites. Key safety features will likely include Standard forward collision warning and automated emergency braking Standard lane departure warning and lane keeping assist Standard blind spot monitoring Warranty and maintenance coverage Mercedes warranty periods align with other luxury automakers, such as Audi and BMW. However, unlike those German competitors, Benz branded models don't include any complementary maintenance. Limited warranty covers 4 years or 50,000 miles. Powertrain warranty covers 4 years or 50,000 miles. Electrical components are covered for 10 years or 100,000 miles. No complementary scheduled maintenance. As more information becomes available, we'll update this story with more details about fuel economy and real-world MPGE. Thank you.